I'm gonna grab the I'm just gonna grab a island for now. Impulse this guy. Alright. Wish I had a Chandra in my deck now. Or a second Chandra in my deck. Want to buy one dig through time worth, please? Dig through time or dragon? That's all I want for Christmas. Dig through time or dragon? Dig through time into dragon? Just have all the things? Yeah, I have no idea what he kept. Like, he kept a hand that just, like, didn't do anything against our controlling deck. Like, he kept a bunch of removal spells, so... I guess when he didn't do anything, I should have assumed the Thunderbreak was going to die, but I was also assuming we'd, like, draw a spell at some point, so... The game's still pretty far from over, though, so we've got some... we got some dress ups here. Okay, man, you got Anissa. This is super, super punished. So if I would have waited to play the Thunderbreak out, we would have uh, hit Runner Runner lands and then played the Thunderbreak with Scorn up and then just been far better off. So now we're just going to get savaged by never having a... Uh, just never having a dragon or drawing a dig. Womp womp. And that's why these decks are, these decks can often leave some to be desired, like, you have a lot of moving pieces, so like, when your one moving piece gets killed, you know. We only play six dragons, but we've also seen, like, you know, 15 cards. And one dragon, one dig, and 15 cards is pretty low. So, dragon this turn would be ideal. And just, you know, drew another land. We got that going for us. So he's going to have uh, seven power next turn, and then we're super dead. This at least is Del Fodder for the dig through time that we will probably die before we draw. Okay, if we draw a dragon next turn, if we dig into dragon next turn, we can go roar, roar, kill your Nissa. We got that going for us. It's all the deck thinning. All right. We only have one in the deck, but we drew it, so you know. How much am I supposed to minus this for? Anyone have the Hardened Scales deck list? We've got plenty of time. I'm looking up the Hardened Scales deck list. Do they have do they have things that mean I need to minus this for more than more than one here? Hardened Scales, Nissa, Jamoka's Command, Valor Stance, Ebden, Falconer, Leap, Secure the Waste, Valor Stance. He could have Jamoka's Command. So I think, I think we're supposed to minus, minus, no, if we do anything, it's minus three because he has, he has Hardened Scales here, which if he, yeah, minus, yeah, so I think we're supposed to minus three. Yeah, so let's just go ahead and... Minus three here. Yeah. So it's minus three. Because if he has Jeroka's command, if he has double Jeroka's command here, he's going to have a giant threat either way. Either way, we're like cleaning up a bunch of his guys so he can't just like minus his Nissa and, and rail us. So yeah, I think just minus three is what we want to do here. <sighs> if we untap with this card, we're probably in a great spot. Either way, like this is. Okay, I don't think they have any instant speed threats. Dramoka's command, sure. So he has two Dramoka's commands, so he's going to get to save this. Man, could you imagine if we'd had one more land? We could have uh, roared this in response. No, he can prevent damage from an instant or sorcery. He can't prevent damage from Chandra. Chandra is a planeswalker. Jamoka's command mode is prevent damage that uh, a, an instant or sorcery would deal this turn. Chandra, Chandra is neither of those things. So Chandra down again in the spot. Needing to draw a dig or a need to draw a dig or a dragon. 
This just gains seven life and draws charge or X is the number of lands you control. So we can draw five cards next turn if we miss. Please worth, please, one more time. Valor stance. All right, well that's one turn late as well. Oh, well, I guess we're just passing back. So I'm assuming he's just gonna draw five cards here. And now we are 19 cards into our deck with one dig, with no digs and one dragon. Hopefully we can uh, use this draw six cards now. Yep, yep. You got it, bud. Hopefully uh, he will play enough spells out that one of these four spikes uh, is lethal. Outlast, Outlast only as a sorcery. Am I supposed to kill this in response? Nah, I think I. Each creature shoots one card. It's flying. Outlast only as a sorcery, so I can just roar this in response if he does anything. So yeah, that's fine. I guess if he has Dramokus, another Dramokus command, that's bad. He's just shipping here, so I'm going to destroy target thing. Do I want to take two here? Yeah, I think I'm just taking two. We don't have any sweepers left in our deck because Chandra is now gone. So, drawn pretty thin if he just goes wide here. <laughs> So the decision to play Thunderbreak on four into a fairly obvious removal spell is what uh, put us behind this game. We've drawn pretty poorly too, but like that decision is what is what definitely took the game out of our favor. Yep, that's a three three hanger back walker. Hey, we do play dig. Sweet. Two, three, four, five, six. Dragons, here there be dragons. Take a Thunderbreak Regent and probably just another dig through time. Yeah, I think I'm just supposed to take another dig through time. We should have, uh, do I have two Chandras in my deck this game? I forget. If we have another Chandra, we might be able to get out of this. He has command and or stance up here. Yeah, definitely. The question is whether or not I'm supposed to jam this Thunder Break into the Hanger Backwalker. I don't think I am. I think I'm just supposed to shut the turn. Now we have to dance around this activation a little bit, so that could be bad too, so. I don't know. We unfortunately don't have double Scorn up. Hey, Finch Punk. Yep. Stream a couple times a week. This is about to get very large. In a normal game of Magic, you can check you can check your sideboard during a game. Uh, I'm asking to get Savage Tier, but I think I have to do this. Uh, otherwise, we just like can't beat we can't beat this much power. So I'm sure he has. Okay, nothing. All right, sweet. Maybe he just like drew really poorly. That would be sweet. Nope. All right. Just dead. Just dead. He's going to have uh, four fours and a three three. This is not a 12 hour stream. The sub goal is when we hit the sub goal, we'll have a 12 hour stream. So just super dead. Uh, fetch and confirm how dead we are, but uh, I think we are. Yep. Boarded out the second Chandra. All right.
I mean, he drew he drew six extra cards with his Nissa after we bricked off for a while. Like we needed to hit the dig one turn sooner or two turns sooner. If, if we would have hit the dig when we hit the Chandra, I think we would have been fine, but we didn't. Uh, he also had double Dramoka's command, which he likely had because like he had just not been doing anything. Uh, I'm no idea. I don't know what's good in standard. That's why we're playing different decks and. Uh, I don't really look at the prices of decks when I build them. Uh, I have black white control. That's uh, that's listed. It's right here. So this is another deck. Uh, we might play in some leagues at some point here. There's only three matches still going, so we're just gonna wait for the next round here. We're playing a five-round uh, qualifying event. I should probably look up when the finals of this event is. See if I can actually play it. So this is what we're playing with here. Yeah, I have no idea how good, good or bad the black white deck is now. I have not played the black white deck since uh, Band Collective Company got introduced. So there's uh, things like that that I'm unsure. I haven't really played the matches. couple hours at least through this qualifying event uh, I own Kiki cord I don't I don't really own any other cards other than that like I have a I have a small stack of modern stuff I've actually been meaning to sell because like I've had it for a while and it's all worth a lot of money now so I plan to ship it but uh, yeah, I don't really own many cards. I actually I use uh, SpareDeckHere.com is really sweet service. They they will rent you cards, which is awesome. So check them out. You can use discount code Hoagland seven to get seven percent off. There's also if you prefer owning cards, you can buy stuff from MPGCardMarket.com and digital cards from Card Hoarder. So you can also a good way to support the stream is to support the sponsors. So feel free to check any of them out. Uh, you play flying creatures and kill them. We um, we kept an awkward seven in game two in this last match and probably misboarded a little, and then um, we flooded out a little bit in the third game. My volume dropped, but yeah, I just set the headset on the floor on the table because I was uh, eating something for lunch. In fact, I might run upstairs and grab something to eat here in a second because I have two matches left. I I refuse to double queue. I don't really want to do that, so. Apologies, there's gonna be a little bit of downtime in between. If we finish a match with uh, a lot of time remaining, we'll we'll queue up a league. But that match went pretty long, so mostly because my uh, opponent was double queued at the start. So it's just, it's just rude. It's it's difficult to watch. It's difficult to play. It's difficult to talk about what I'm doing. Uh, it's rude to make your opponent sweat on Magic Online. So just you know, don't double queue. Just don't do it, kids. This deck seems like it's got a lot of good tools, though. We've got uh, a couple of man lands here in the mana base, so we gain that as well. Chandra's hot at the top end. Uh, Dig Through Time still just, you know, busted magic card. It's only only legal and standard, and then it's going to be, like, vintage restricted. Hot swap to some hex. I actually haven't gotten hex set up yet on the new computer. Uh, we might we might do that in between. Because I, uh, I could play the hex campaign and uh, play that in between. I can pause that. Volume's a little here. <laughs> 